so many things that you guys hit on today that were amazing. So the events, I love doing events, but I have spent a ton of money on events over the years. And so now what this year I'm going to do is I'm actually going to volunteer at the downtown Martinez events that they have. Um, so instead of me spending $1,500 every time that I want to do an event, which I'm still planning on doing three events throughout this year, but I can now go attend these events, be a volunteer, like for the um, Christmas Santa Claus, Santa Crawl, we saw 1,500 people come in that day. And I personally put wristbands on each one of those people. And we got to be there with our smiling faces and just enjoying it. So that is something that if you don't have right now the money to do that, you can go volunteer at these community events, right? And just get to know your community. Um, for me, having things written in front of me, like I've got my calendar on this side of me. I've got my paychecks on this side of me. I've got my unit goals here. Like, I wish I could turn my camera so you guys could see what I see, but I have to see things like written out and on postcard or a post-it that I have on my desk that I look at every single day is my priorities. So I drilled in to see last year, where did my money come from? Where did my checks come from? It was open houses, SOI and past deals, online lead generation and company generated leads and agent to agent referrals. So that's what I'm doubling in on this year. And then check this out. Mark bought me this whiteboard. It's like a miniature whiteboard and it goes on your desk because I'm a doodler and I have my to-do list on there. And then with the calendar, so Elias, in the beginning of us working together, um, really showed me that my time management skills or reminded me that my time management skills really need to be like at the forefront of my mind all the time. So what I do now, like Ernesto, on Sundays, I sit down for an hour and I time block this out. So the first thing that goes on here are non-negotiables. Like I will not miss my morning prep, my meditation, my exercise, my getting myself dressed, the reds or meetings that I cannot miss. But like if I move over to next week, it's already planned out. Like there are non-negotiables that we should be doing. Family time, time off. These flex time blocks, like if I get done with work early on this Monday, I'm just going to move this flex time block down. And then if I keep moving it down, shoot, I might have a whole day off if I don't use those time blocks. It's huge. Um, and just, you know, do things that make you uncomfortable. But the things that make you comfortable that you know you're killing it at, double down on that stuff. Like if you've gotten so many leads from on from open houses and you know how to do that really well, gain more knowledge and more power within that and make that like the top thing that you're doing, but still go out and door knock if that makes you uncomfortable too.